Hi YWCA Canada, welcome to Edmonton, Alberta. I'm going to show you our new office. Follow along. A big part of 2021-2022 has been our office move. We went from our downtown office that was on the fourth floor of a building to this new street level, very accessible, barrier free office that features both counseling offices, a children's play therapy room, and office space. And it's we built our office to be hybrid. So it also includes lots of flexible spaces for community to gather, our partners to gather as we continue our work. There's lots of neat features. Follow me. I want to show you a couple of things, including this really neat area that we're calling the Bellamy Salon. After our very first president in 1907, it's an area for both staff and the public to gather and to do our equity work. This is a space for our staff to have lunch, but also to, you know, have book lunches or to gather with our partners to do some of our work. And we're really excited about this historic mural. It chronicles 115 years of our history serving women and families in our community and we couldn't be more proud to, to display it for all to see. which is the site of many Zoom calls, particularly with my colleagues in the rest of Alberta. The four YWs have been meeting during the pandemic on a weekly basis at the start and now every, every twice a month. And we discuss everything from the uh, childcare deal that was established between the uh, Canadian government and Alberta last fall and women's participation in the workforce uh, following COVID-19. You know, these conversations have been invaluable and in our partnerships on everything from, you know, sharing IT knowledge to talking about the latest things that are happening on the ground with domestic violence survivors. It's been an incredible partnership and I can't thank those women enough for all of the hard work that's happened during the pandemic. So hopefully next time you're in Edmonton, you drop by our new office on 124th Street we're so excited, not just about what we can do now, but in the future as we serve our community. Thanks and bye from Edmonton.